So hi dear Aquarius, a very very good evening to you guys. This is Anjali Tarot and this is a general reading for all the Aquarius Sun Moon Venus rising. Keep in mind this is general. It might or might not resonate with you at the first place. The second thing, this is a reading from 5th till the 11th of December. So let's start. Aquarius, your overall energy for this week. How it is going to be for you guys. Let's see. Aquarius. Eight of Cups, okay, you will be walking away from something or someone, okay, you will be like, I no, no longer want to be at uh, on that place where I'm not happy, okay, where I, uh, nobody is respecting me or where nobody cares for me or loves me or something like this, you will be feeling a sense of detachment and you will be willingly walking away from something or someone because it's not helping you anymore, it's not making you happy anymore, there's nothing left in this uh, situation for you. So you will be choosing to walk away from people or situation that's no longer making you happy and it's a very brave step. Beautiful. Cool. Let's see how your health is going to be. Okay, two of wands. So you are uh, you are uh, starting some kind of alternative medicine thing or you have decided that you are going to wait for the medicines for the thing to give you results. For some of you, you have options. You have, uh, you have uh, kept a backup option as well. If it, this regime or this fitness regime or this... Uh, fitness sorry this fitness regime or this medicine or this uh, therapy is not going to work for me i am going to uh, stick to my old version old thing so you are going to start something new in terms of your health a new gym a new yoga classes might be another form of yoga or might be another form of gymming or swimming or something like this that you weren't doing from a very long time and you started doing this so you will be hoping for some kind of results from that okay you will be waiting for some kind of results hmm Please beware of digestive issues. A lot of digestion issues, digestive issues are going to crop up. If you are traveling and you are going to eat a lot of food, a lot of outside food, it's definitely going to mess up with your digestive system. Please beware of that kind of energies. And please beware, of, I think you should eat a lot of pomegranate, red fruits, red vegetables. It's going to help you a lot, right? Please do that. Get your HB checked also. Okay, let's see Aquarius. How your finances are going to be in this week king of swords so you're going to get some kind of clarity and truth some kind of clarity or truth is coming out regarding your finances or saving or investment or something like this something that was not clear till now for you it's going to be very clear for you okay and you're going to uh, take a very very harsh decision regarding your finances it might hurt a lot of people around you or it might hurt uh, you also might be but you have to take that decision and you are going to do that because something that was not uh, clear till now something that was not giving you the good results that you're wanting from that it's going to happen now the clarity the truth is going to come out okay if you're a student let's see Aquarius how it is going to be for you two of swords so if you're a student you will not be able to understand which direction is good one for you you will be kind of blindfolded by your own thoughts you will be in this energy of I don't know which direction to choose so I think this week you should not do and you should not take any kind of decision because these are temporary feelings, these are temporary issues. This is a temporary phase where you are not able to decide. So once these things are going to settle down, write down everything that's important for you and that you want to do and act accordingly. But this week you should not do anything I think. Just uh, uh, wait and watch for these energies to settle down. Okay, like uh, if you are doing job, let's see. Ace of Swords, a brand new job offer is coming your way, okay, a truth, again, truth, clarity, so Aquarius, I do see in your life in this one week, lots of truth and lots of clarity is coming in lots of areas of your life, okay, a brand new job offer or you are going to get a job offer after a very long period of struggle and fight and um, bad luck and you were not able to get it, there was some kind of job or some sort of job or career that you really, really wanted to do and it was not happening. Now in this week, you will get a chance to make it happen. And you are going to feel very proud of you. I am so proud of you, Aquarius. Some kind of brand new start, brand new chapter in your career in terms of your job. If you are doing business, let's see how it is going to be for you. Six of Pentacles, okay. You will find yourself in a balanced state of mind. You will be uh, having this energy of whatever is coming. It's like flow. It's like equal give and take of money. So whatever you are going to uh, invest, you are going to get in return. I don't see a huge uh, kind of returns and a huge uh, kind of uh, benefits happening. I don't see that, but it will be like equal give and take of energy. Like uh, the flow is going to be there. It's like a cycle. 
the more you are going to invest the more you are going to get but not uh, a huge benefit or not huge amounts of benefits is happening here so you have to be have you will be having a balanced week when it comes to your uh, business i hope you are getting my point i don't see huge success huge benefits i do see just a flow of income right let's see if you are single aquarius how it is going to be for you Three of Pentacles. You will be working in a team, or you will be working in some. Uh, might be you are going to have office romance, or you are going to start liking somebody from your office, a boss, or a colleague, or somebody like this. But it could be very much possible that this somebody is already married, or already committed to somebody else, or already in a relationship, or something like this. Please, like this. Please, please, please stay away from that situation. You are going to regret it later, otherwise. Okay. So office romance is forcing here, but again, I don't see this person is completely single. or single at all you might end up regretting this so please be aware of that cool if you are in relationship 10 of pentacles i do see a committed and happy kind of relationship coming your way finally you are going to feel yourself uh, that you are going to be in a committed happily ever after kind of energy it's going to be a very good period of growth and expansion in your um, relationship especially financially so for uh, detailed love reading you can go back to my channel and check your sign you are going to find it what is the guidance for you people Nine of Wands. Do not give up. Simple. Do not give up on uh, anything that you really, really want to do in your life. You, uh, uh, as long as it is not a specific person that you are stuck on, and you are like, this is a toxic person, but I want them back. Don't do that, honey. It's your loss. Okay. They are good in their life. They are doing really good in their life without you. Also, you are the one who is suffering, and you still want a toxic person back in your life. It's up to you. So, but do not give up on something like uh, it, it's your health. or it's your money issues or it's your job or career it's something that really really meant for you means to you just don't give up and uh, if you want to have a sp or specific person that's up to you because i don't really really understand the point of sp who always uh, put you in a very difficult situation anyway so th that's your time that's your job so thank you so much for tuning in aquarius i'll see you soon in the next video bye bye take care god bless you namaste